If your A-level results are not quite what you had hoped for this year, then this video is for you. And even if you did get good A-levels, then this video will also be useful to you as well. Now, this is in respect to a tweet. So first of all, an apology, this is not a legal explanatory video. This is something of an opinion video, but also a bit of a motivational video. But I felt that it's right to do it because I was slightly annoyed by a tweet from a Labour MP that I responded to. This was to say that the Education Secretary was plain wrong and downright rude and needed to apologise for a comment about A-levels. In essence, trying to encourage those that didn't get the A-level results they wanted to say that in 10 years' time, those qualifications won't be relevant. This was the tweet. She said, hard work matters, results matter. Now, I do agree with the hard work bit, but I'm going to come back to that. Um, Bridget Philipson, Labour MP, said, that's why the Education Secretary is telling young people that the qualifications they get today won't be relevant in 10 years' time isn't just plain wrong, it's downright rude. She's talking down England's young people and she needs to apologise. Now you can see on screen that I replied to this tweet to say, to be fair, my A-levels had absolutely nothing to do with being successful in business or becoming a barrister. But I do agree that hard work matters. Because I've been in business for many, many years and turned over millions of pounds, I'd like to think that I'm successful. And I came back to education later and I did my law degree with Open University, which has no formal entry requirements. Now, as it happens, I did get reasonably good A-level results, but they were nothing to do with getting on the uh, LLB course with Open University. I achieved through sheer hard work whilst running my business and my family life by getting up at 3 or 4 a.m. in the morning and doing this for three years straight with Open University and got my first class LLB honours degree with Open University. And I thoroughly enjoyed it. It was that that got me onto the master's course at BPP, incorporating the then BPTC, now uh, BTC, and I got a distinction in my LLM legal practice for barristers and then became a barrister. I still run my businesses for what it's worth. Now, this is why I say hard work does matter. And results do matter depending on the circumstances, but this is a motivational video for you because this story I've told before, so forgive me if you've heard it before, but when I was 16, I was asked what kind of profession that I would want to go into, what kind of work that I would want to do. And to go and think about it, can find some work experience and that sort of thing. So I did two different, very different types of work experience. One was going into um, work for a uh, music shop and uh, music school. The other was what we refer to as a mini pupillage, which is following a barrister around in, in court. And when I went back to the careers advisor, I said, I would love to be a barrister. She said, well, forget it because it's too expensive, too competitive, too difficult, and you'll never make it. I said, well, the only other thing I would like to do is go into business. And she said the same thing. She said, it'd be too expensive, too, too difficult, too competitive, and you'll never make it. Most businesses fail and most people are not successful at becoming a barrister. But since then, I've run successful businesses. I've had my difficulties over the time. You know, it hasn't all been plain sailing. It's been a lot of hard work and... I still have those businesses and I also fulfilled that dream of becoming a barrister. So for those of you that may not have had the results that you really hoped for, the results don't necessarily matter in that sense. Because if you get people tell you that you've blown it because you didn't get the results you wanted, then the results don't matter because you can always come through and achieve your goals and your dreams. If that's what you want to do, you want to become a barrister, let's say you didn't get the results to get into uh, a traditional university for your law degree, you could enrol with Open University. You could go through and get a fantastic grade there, which could get you onto the bar course. And then you can demonstrate your hard work and determination, which the one feedback that I had from everybody that I discussed this with, the Open University degree that is, is that Doing a degree with Open University is a lot of hard work. More hard work, perhaps, 
than doing it at a traditional, let's say, a red brick university, because there are no lectures as such. You are just sent the books. You're given some guidance. There's some um, catch up uh, sessions, review sessions every now and again, which just check that you are on track. And otherwise you do the work yourself at home. So I was up at three or four in the morning, virtually every morning for three years or so. I didn't do it over, you know, four, five, six years or whatever. I did it over three years. And I got my law degree because when I first went to university, it wasn't for law. And you either need the law degree to get onto the bar course or you need the conversion or whatever. I chose to do the law degree and go straight in. So this was by, uh, I suppose, a little bit of a gripe with this message here. Um, because, yes, hard work matters. I absolutely believe that. Uh, all success comes with hard work. And all real success, anyway. And results can matter. But if you didn't get the results you want and you see this and think that it's all over, that's wrong. And that's why, Bridget, I don't entirely agree uh, with this tweet here. And I don't think that the Education Secretary needs to uh, apologise for this comment. Because in 10 years' time, she's right, no one will be looking back at your A-levels from today. So there's my true story. I hope it helps somebody that feels disappointed and... Even those of you that did get the grades that you want, but maybe you haven't quite yet figured things out, but maybe you think that you have no chance of a career at a barrister or something like that. You absolutely do. You absolutely can. Uh, it just comes with the hard work. So the hard work bit, I agree with. It's passion and determination and hard work. Those things matter. So I would tweak that and I would say hard work, dedication and passion matter. And with those, you can achieve what you wish. Leave me your thoughts and comments below. Please do like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. <music>